Okay, so this is the leading edge of the keel. And you can see where the passage was for the moisture coming up to bolt hole number one. So you can see all sorts of voids in the Cicaflex where it was. Now, I'll show you the keel in a moment because I have not scraped the keel yet. And you can see here where this was a total void. Look at all these voids that we've got in here on the uh, on the Cicaflex. All sorts of it. All sorts of it. More voids. Look at this. All these. These are all voids, and there's no mating Cicaflex uh, on the keel itself. Now we're coming up to bolt hole number two. Okay. And again, you can see the voids. Now, what this white stuff is here, I have no idea. It's not salt. So I've looked at that, tasted it. It is not salt. I don't know what that white actually is. But again, you can see more voids here, which do not match with the uh, the male uh, the, the keel itself right now we're looking at the keel stub and again i don't know what this white stuff actually is okay continuing to move back this is bolt hole number four right here and the voids are the bad back here and the keel was not leaking back here. But again, we see all this white stuff that's here, which is, again, is not salt. Okay, now we're coming back here a little bit further. And this is bolt hole number five. That's here. And it looks like Zika Flex isn't bad in this area here. And then coming back, bolt hole number six, which is just a, a littler one. And again, for the most part, there's no voids, but you see the white stuff here again. Now we're coming back and we've got bolt hole number seven. That's right here. Bolt hole number seven is right here. And it looks good. These are, these are two smaller bolt holes that go through there. And just a quick scan all the way back. Okay, I'll try that again. That's number seven. That's right there. Number six. Number five. Right there. In the back. There's number four. There's number three. Sorry, that's number that's number four right there. Sorry. Now, that's bolt hole number three. Let's to zoom in and here on these on these voids. Look at this. Damn it! I was having the problem. Was up forward here, and this is where you can see all of these voids that are taking place in the Cicaflex where it just didn't take. It does not appear that any primer was used because it just didn't take.